Hello and welcome to today's new construction home tour. I'm staring straight into the sun, so I'm squinting. Forgive me, I don't even know if you'll be able to see the home behind me, but it's the Prescott by Lennar uh, in Red Rocks Ranch. You can see the mountains, guys, over my shoulder. You are right in the foothills of the mountains here. Not even, you're the bait, you're, you are in the mountains here. Um, guys, if you're new to my channel, before we jump into the home, I'll make this really quick. My name is Tori, if you're new to my channel. I'm a local guy and a realtor who does a ton of work in the new construction space. So if you are considering a new construction home, I would love for you to leverage the the relationships that I have built with these sales reps, the builders who bring in as much business as I have. So please feel free to reach out. I'm not making any promises on the internet. However, I have a great track record of negotiating extra incentives, good deals with my clients because of experience and relationships. Overall, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Hit like and hit subscribe. Prescott Lennard, Red Rocks Ranch, let's go. All right, here's a quick exterior shot. We are gonna jump straight into the home in a moment. We got, you can see, got a nice little front patio right up there. We got two car garage on the left hand side and a third car garage right there as well with its own entrance into the home. And guys, let's go ahead and jump in. The door is locked. I'm gonna go straight from our exterior here to inside the house, but here we go. All right, so that's where I was outside filming the exterior. Now this is the front door and this is your entry way now this is an interesting space because we got doors on both sides you could use it as an office i couldn't really make it a bedroom i guess it could it doesn't have a, it doesn't have a closet it'd be a little bit weird as a bedroom but you do you let's walk through the other side here so you can see got a guest bathroom here and then they're using this for part of the design studio and they have their, their office set up over there. So coming into the home, boom, here, guest bath, guest bedroom, this space, and then a very, very good sized refrigerator in living in space with lots of light, high ceilings. Once you get to the living room, I always like the dramatic look of having, being able to see top floor like that. And you got room for a dining table as well and a patio. We'll explore the kitchen and the living room and we'll head on up. And guys, where it just came from, where their office is, that's where the garage would be. So you'd be coming in, if you're coming in from the garage, you'd be coming in there where we just walked through, coming through the front door, you'd be coming in around this side. Guys, I, I have to open this. Oh my gosh, this is so big. Wow, jeez. Good size walk-in pantry, nothing crazy big, but big enough, that is for sure. We'll head down here and make, we'll make this part quick. This is an unfinished basement. Forgive the shaky camera. Just wanna give you guys a feel of what the basement looks like. You got this side to the left, boom. To the right and of course it wraps around and they have a rough in for plumbing already apologies if you want me to spend more time down here most people probably don't so i'm gonna make that part quick got their own little wine fridge as well very nice All right, let's check out this back patio. You can see what the neighborhood's looking like a little bit. Once again, you can see just how close you are to the mountains, which is like <laughs> at the bottom of them. A very good sized patio. Oh. 
Whoop. Sorry guys, one sec. All right. I mean, come on guys, look at that view. That's very cool. So once again, that's the front door. Third car garage right here. Cause once again, this is a three car garage. I'm sure you saw that for the exterior, but I probably should explain that. So yeah, the third car garage right here and the main two car garage over there. What I explained earlier. guest bedroom. Guys, we are ready to head on upstairs. So coming up, hitting the top of the stairs, right behind me, this first bedroom is the primary bedroom. We are gonna save that for last. So let's go to the left. You got your laundry room, which is connected to the primary bedroom. I'm always a very, very big fan of that. Imagine how easy unloading laundry is when you have the laundry room connected to the primary bedroom, which is very, very cool. Now this great loft space. That overlooks the home. bathroom very conveniently right off of the loft as well hello that is me by the way guys quick promo if you are liking the video hit like and hit subscribe it means a lot it's a cheesy ask but it helps a lot either way though thank you for watching the video that's awesome back to the tour it's just cool that you can see the houses and then right right there those are mountains baby beautiful all right, guest bedroom, very spacious. And we'll go, we're gonna go explore that other bedroom in a moment that connects the Jack and Jill bath, but you got a walk-in closet there and a sink on this side in a doorway. So whoever was staying here, and the other side of the room is the same thing. I have a door right there. It's private here, private private sink area, private um, closet, obviously. Now, whoever gets this bedroom is probably the favorite child because they are on their own little island all the way in the corner of the house here. It's a smaller bedroom than the other one, however. So are they the favorite child? I don't know. Maybe it's the least favorite child because you want them further away from everybody. <laughs> oh, I'm just kidding. Same situation over here. All right, guys. Moment you've been waiting for. Grand finale. Primary bedroom time. Look at those mountains, guys. Come on. If you can't tell, I'm a big Denver fan. All right, drum roll, here we go. Bada boom. That ain't nice and big primary bath. Once again, that, can, that laundry room connects, got a linen closet. Good sized enough counters here. Dual headed shower. 
big plus. Toilets. And then, look at this. Big old closet. Space. Which connects to the laundry room right here. Guys, that concludes today's tour. Once again, if you liked the video, hit like and subscribe. And once again, I would love for you to leverage the relationships I have built through doing as much work as I've done with builders. So if you are thinking about doing anything in the new build space and resale, if I do resale as well, feel free to reach out. My contact information is in the YouTube description below. Thank you guys for watching. See you on the next one.